Hi, this is GBPUSD and today it's Monday 21st of September 2015 and the time is 14.53 GMT. I'm Sofia Stavropoulou and this is a video signal for Forex ID Academy members, FXholics, Forex Signal subs users and WhatsApp Signal subscribers. I'm using the Chimoku Kinko Hio, Bollinger Bands, Fractals and Stochastics. This is the H4 time frame of GBPUSD and we see here a big downward move has started and uh, I doubt it will stop at the medium Bolger band where it's balancing right now on H4 and it would not even stop on the medium Bolger band of daily it will most possibly reach Kijensen level on weekly or even the lower Bolger band on weekly before uh, reversing and continuing up. So um, let's see if we can. We see the price uh, made an up, a strong upward move. It touched the upper Bollinger Band on daily. It made a swing high above the medium Bollinger Band, which is not completed. It will be com completed when a, a candlestick will close below the medium Bollinger Band. But this candlestick pattern here with these two huge spikes, double top lower close the two candlesticks which are all, all also touching the upper bulge bud and forming this pattern above the Kumo uh, this is a strong bearish continuation pattern and let's see how it will progress biases are strongly bearish um, let's see if we can enter from a time frame with the lower possible lowest possible risk so we see here on H1 that the Bollinger Bands have made a, a narrow bottleneck and the funnel is opening now and we are at the moment of the uh, just just on time to enter short when the breakout is about to start so when this candlestick closes and it goes it closes below the lower Bolger band as it seems with the upper and lower Bolger bands edges turned outwards as they are with the medium Bolger bands uh, sloping downwards curved downwards Tenkan Sen ankle downwards Kijun Sen sloping downwards and Tsiku Span having crossed below past price action going down and Stochastics going down everything is too good to be true right now <laughs> Uh, you enter short at 1.5490 let's uh, let the price go another seven pips lower and place your stop loss above the uh, this up fractal here above the upper bones band where the bottleneck is at 1.5565 and uh, ideally you can place it above the plateau of Kijun Sen okay but it's if it is too too high risk for you above this up fractal here is just fine staying while the candlesticks on H1 close below Tenkan Sen the red line of Ichimoku Kinko Hill exit when a bullish candlestick on H1 closes above Tenkan Sen trail your stop loss following uh, Kijun Sen Plateaus. Kijun Sen is the blue line of Ichimoku Kinko Hill. A few pips above Kijun Sen Plateaus. And if you want to be uh, very conservative and uh, save your pips. Uh, but this looks like it is going to be a strong move. So um, I will give you a take profit target here. The first take profit target will be the medium bolts band on daily which is uh, 95 pips away but the kids and sand level on weekly which is uh, 247 pips lower 234 pips lower is not a bad idea either so um, have a take profit target as just at the back on the back side of your mind but 
I think it's safer to follow the the stain index criteria I gave you stain while the candlesticks will close below 10 consent exit when a bullish candlestick closes above 10 consent and if you see that all your short entry criteria are met again jump in short and continue the ride uh, as the price falls lower but why why uh, not uh, making your pips your nice pips fast and putting them in your pocket why not so this is it for now thanks for watching and happy pips